Neil Schusterman, welcome to AM Buffalo. Oh, happy to be here. Um, I have your book. I'm very excited. I want to start with you virtually. Can you virtually sign my book? Yes, of course. There you go. Oh, there we have it. Oh, it looks fantastic. Great signature. You know it's there. I know it's there. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. It is such a great book. I've got to say, I'm really enjoying reading this during the pandemic because I used to fantasize about having a parallel existence. And I love that Ash, the lead character, he just lives all these, you know, slowly more and more parallel lives come out for him. Mm -hmm. Like the pandemic is kind of like a parallel world. We all had our lives and now it's like we got freaking slammed in the faces and now we're living this different same same but different life as a writer do you ever think where your book might land in the future and how it might help people ah uh, it's always my hope that the stories will be universal and will not be just of a time but will last uh, but at the same time i want to make sure that they they hit the moment exactly when it's needed and i think game changer does that I always get worried that I'm going to give away too much. So if I do any spoiler alerts, you can just go, ah, and I'll edit it afterwards. I'll put a little tape <laughs> over. <laughs> but Ash's life is altered every time he's in a tackle in his high school football matches. We can say that, mm -hmm. right? <laughs> yeah, he, he has these power tackles and they start bouncing him into alternate realities. And, uh, you know, the story is about learning empathy. You know, he's this fairly oblivious white heterosexual male, but in the course of the story, he is going to have all of his notions of the world and of himself challenged. He has this crash course in racism, sexism, homophobia, and privilege through this series of world-bending events that hit him harder than he hits on the field. I love the fact that it is young adult, and even though I like to think I'm young adult, I guess I'm very much an adult adult. Um, but we it, are all young adult. We're all young adult. But it really is something that anyone can enjoy reading. And so I definitely say yes, great pandemic reading, as I said. But I want to I want to know, you, you say that you don't like to write um, in a room locked up because you feel like you're in detention. <laughs> <laughs> I've had to change my habits because of, of the pandemic and because of being, you know, in, in quarantine for a year. So, you know, I used to do a lot of traveling and I would do most of my writing when I was out on speaking engagements around the country, around the world. And so I would always find really interesting places to write. You know, my favorite place I ever wrote was the Sistine Chapel. I sat in the Sistine Chapel for two hours and wrote before they kicked me out. That is phenomenal. So no wonder you have such an interesting mind when it comes to writing stories. And um, yeah, game changer, really, really great read. Neil Shusterman, thank you so, so much for joining us on AM Buffalo. And um, have you ever signed a virtual copy of a book before? I have not done that. This, well, this has been the most fun interview I've done all day. Oh, really? <laughs> yes. So thank you. Yay! Oh my gosh. Oh no, thank you. It is a really good book, Game Changer. I'm still, I haven't finished it yet. I'm still reading it. You can get a copy wherever good books are sold.